What's going on guys, it's Screecher and today we are going to be talking about the game breaking glitch in Crash Team Racing Nitro Fooled. Now if you've clicked on this video or googled it or stumbled across it, you will more than likely know what I am talking about. But essentially when you open up your Crash game, you'll have an error code come up, something along the lines of Crash Team Racing global save data has been corrupted all data has been deleted. Now you might notice there that I just simply did not have a lot of characters and I can assure you if you've watched my streams and you've watched my videos that I do have all the characters and that's because I've been affected by this glitch five times now. As of making this video five times I had it done once on the day of release, I had it once on the second day, I had it twice yesterday and I've already had it today, today being the 27th of June. 2019 now essentially this error is a glitch in the system and there is nothing you can do to permanently fix it however there is a temporary fix that will stop you from losing all of your data and all of your skins and all of your um, save files and characters and stuff that you have this isn't a permanent fix so please be mind of that and you should do this as often as you feel like Every time you do a race that you've maybe struggled on or every time you've grinded for a skin, you should probably do what I'm about to show you now. This will stop you from losing it every time you get the corrupted save data. Now, before I go ahead and show you, I would like to tell you that I have had messages from Activision, Beanox and PlayStation saying that they are aware of this glitch, but they have not found the fix for it yet. You can go ahead and tweet them at Activision support, PlayStation support and they will probably get back to you with the same message. Without further ado, let's roughly show you how to get the temporary fix for this. So when you go into your files, you'll have something along the line of this. Save slot 1 and slave slot 2 are your adventure mode progresses. The reason I have 2 is because before I did this, I lost all of the characters that I unlocked in adventure mode and had to do another save slot to unlock them all again. That's Fate Crash, Pinstripe, uh, Komodo Joe, uh, Papu Papu and Ripperoo. If you have already been affected by this glitch and not done it, you will have to do the adventure mode and do it again. And if you go ahead and fire up your save data that you currently have, it is very glitchy. You'll start going into races where it tells you um, you do not have enough relics and that to do this race, but you do and the warp pad is open. It's very glitchy, but it is quite funny to watch and play. So here is how you fix it. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need to do, this is for PlayStation, is press the PSM button and go to your settings. Then you're going to need to go to Application Save Data Management. From there, you need to press Save Data in System Storage. This is important that you press Upload to Online Storage. Do not copy it to USB or any of that. From there, you're going to find the game, which is, of course, Crash, and then upload it to the System Storage. Once you've done that, you are safe. Wherever you have saved this setting right now is essentially your save point if you get corrupted data you can backtrack it to this point so if you go ahead and play the game now for another hour or two and unlock another skin that you really 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 do not want to do again you should do this again and overwrite that data do not overwrite the data when you get the corrupted file or once again you will lose everything and have to start again so what happens when you get the corrupted data how do you backtrack it well you need to go to the home page where you have the icon for Crash. You need to press the Options button. You'll have a little thing come up where it says Upload slash Download Saved Data. You need to go to this and press Download All on your global save. What this essentially does is, as you can see on the left, I have the corrupted file. It replaces the corrupted file with the last time you uploaded it to the online storage. And I can't stress this enough, guys. This glitch might be fixed in a day. This glitch might never be fixed. But the game is broken. And unfortunately, this is the only way I know to fix it and stop you from continuously losing your data. So... Without further ado guys, hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you like Crash content, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned, because I'm playing this game no end of times. All my friends have it now, and I'm going to be streaming this game. I'm playing this game just about every day. So, yeah, you should probably subscribe. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. Like I said, please do everything, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.